guess what? We just finished our podcast with Dr. Pimple Popper. It was incredible. We talked about pimples. We watched pimple videos. I popped pimples with her. How do you feel? I feel great. Thank you. You, you were the best. Oh, that's what's popping. <laughs> Check it out, SoundCloud.com slash Jada Friends. Hi, peasants. I don't know if you know this or not, but I'm fucking Instagram famous. Like, call me fucking Adele because I'll win all the Grammys. Like, if you go to my profile, you'll see that I'm the most followed person on Instagram with, like, hundreds of millions of followers. So, yeah, I'm pretty much the most famous person there is on Instagram. Also, I post really exciting photos of my really fucking exciting life. Like this one, and this one, and oh my god, don't even get me started on this one. What a fucking crazy night with the besties. And now I have this perfect fucking dog who's always ready for her perfect fucking pose. Yeah, you fucking wish you were us. So since we live like a queen, now it's time to eat like a queen. So today I have all of your favorite Instagram foods and I'm ready to try them. Also, if you don't understand sarcasm, I'm sorry. Because when I said I'm famous, I meant I'm trash. And when I said I should win some Grammys, I meant hammies. Literally just ham. Throw ham at me. I'll eat it. Uh, no. I'm a trash can. I'm disgusting. Uh, my Instagram is gross and depressing. Feel free to follow. But I am obsessed with people who post all these, like, fancy Instagram foods because I've never tried any of them. So I went out to all the whitest places I could find and I brought back some Grammy food, bitch. I'm talking boba. I'm talking akuku bowls. So here we go. Get ready for the most basic food trying video ever. Okay, so first we need to try what I have seen on every white bitch's Instagram, avocado toast. Let me take a selfie. Okay, so I have never tried this, and like, I'm not mad at it. Like, I love guacamole, I love bread, I would never put the two together because I'm not on crack. I mean, I would fuck up bread and ranch. But like, that works because the ranch soaks into the pores of the bread, and it becomes like a big ranch sponge. You have not lived until you have taken a whole loaf of bread, cut open the inside, poured an entire bottle of ranch inside of that, put it under your shirt went to see boo Medea's Halloween and just had yourself a day. Happy hurler wern. Oh cur. <laughs> I don't know what that was. That was definitely not Medea. Anyways, back to white people. Mmm, avocado toast. Uh, I mean, it doesn't look that bad. It definitely looks like SpongeBob after an accident or after a night. He got fucked in all holes. He has all the diseases. Patrick's even like, sorry, bitch. I'm gonna go hang out with that rat with the bowl on her head because like I don't wanna be around this. Squidward would fuck though. It doesn't smell like anything. Here's the thing, it's just avocado, it's not guacamole. As a food, avocado is boring. It tastes like nothing. All right, but here we go. I'm gonna try it for myself and see if it makes me insta-famous or give me instant diarrhea. Either way, give it a like. It's giving me the same feelings boo a Medea Halloween gave me. It's so bad it hurts, but I can't stop. I don't know how I feel about this. Like the bread is just mushy, the avocado is mushy. All together, it's just a lot of mush. Like if I wanted a bunch of mushy on my Instagram, I would take my shirt off. <laughs> I don't know, I don't see what all the gurus see in this. I don't think this is gonna satisfy me. If anything, it's just gonna make me want chips and guacamole, which by the way, I need to stop. I had a gallon of guacamole yesterday. A fucking gallon. You know what my shit looked like? My ass was making Grammys, okay? My ass was making hashtag brunch life and the eggs were not over easy, bitch. <laughs> oh no, they came in hard. Who and they came out with a fight, but it's okay. I scrambled them and I gobbled them down. What am I talking about? <laughs> Next food. All right, this one, I fucking can't. I fucking hate everybody. What the fuck is this? This is called an exuhai, I'm not even gonna try to pronounce it, a kakai bowl. Let me take a selfie. A chai chai, a kai kai, a kiki palmer, bitch, I don't know. It's literally just a bowl of purple goop with some fucking fruit on top and what looks to be nuts. I don't know. Why would you eat that? Also, this is breakfast to some people. This, that is breakfast. This looks like a weird fucking Nickelodeon meal. Like if the little sister in Drake and Josh was like, I'll make you breakfast. And then she fucking cooks up some shit in a lab and tries to kill Josh Peck and Drake Bell. All right, I'm gonna give this a try. It's very cold. <laughs> I don't, ugh. It just looks like yogurt, and you know how much I hate yogurt. Oh my god, ew, ew. It's so LA, it makes me fucking sick. Do they have this where you live? Like, if you live in like Ohio, or like somewhere where people fuck cows, like, do you have this? I could see a girl living in like the middle of butt fuck nowhere who like follows all these grammars. Like going to her mom and being like, Mom, can we have a Nakai Kai bowl for dinner? And her mom being like, go fuck a cow. 
Be like your sister, go fuck that cow, go eat that chicken, and go marry your brother. All right, I'm gonna mix this all up because I just want it to be the same color. I don't know, I don't like the variety. Like I know it's a pleasing aesthetic. <laughs> I literally can't say that word without living. But I don't give a fuck. Here we go, fuck your aesthetic. Ah! <laughs> ah! Oh my god. <laughs> it tastes like cold vomit, which is a better vomit because hot vomit tends to burn the throat, whereas a cold vomit tends to feel refreshing on a summer day. But this, the flavors, oh my god, it's like yogurt mixed with old popsicles, mixed with white girls who say lit, and also soccer moms who are trying to say shook, but they say shake, and it's uncomfortable for everybody. Honey, get in the car, let's get shaken. That's not how you say it, mom. Uh-oh, she drugged me. No, mom, it's dragged. No, I'm actually drugged because of you. You ruined my life. And the more pills I take, the less I want to kill myself and kill you. What? Are you shook, bitch? Am I using it right? Ugh, next food. So now the most basic of them all, the boa tea. Let me take a selfie. So this has been in every Instagram. There's nothing a white girl loves more than putting her mouth over a big thick tube and sucking up all those little slimies. And listen, I agree. I don't know what fucking world these people live in where they're like, ooh, you know what would be good in my drink? Fucking boogers. Like actual fucking little creepy gross fucking boogers that get stuck in my throat. Like give me a big McDonald's milkshake and just like, Throw a bunch of boogers in there. I want each sip to be fucking gross. <laughs> I want to hate the whole experience. Because there's no way people like that. There's no way. All right, here we go. I'm going to give this a try. I definitely tried boba before. Not this type. And all I remember is literally screaming. So headphone users beware. All right, here we go. It's pretty good. Tastes like a, kind of tastes like iced tea. All right, let's take another sip. Oh my god, there's like three in my mouth right now. Ah! Eh. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, the way they're sliding around my mouth. Uh. <laughs> it's like little roaches. Uh. Oh, I kind of like it though. It's like a little gum massage. This is kind of everything. It's kind of like there's something alive inside of me. I have never felt that. What do they look like? <laughs> Ugh. Try to cut it in half. Am I Instagram famous yet? <laughs> I love it. <laughs> My next Instagram. Boba Life. Let me take a selfie. Okay, I surprisingly didn't hate that. I can't believe I didn't hate that. Because I definitely hated that in the past. But for some reason, I don't hate it now. I was going to say me, but no. <laughs> Still a lot of hatred. Now, there's nothing an Instagram model loves more than a healthy little breakfast. You know, just a nice little crepe covered in Nutella filled with strawberries and whipped cream and powdered sugar. That's right. We're not talking about crap. We're talking about crepe. Let me take a selfie. That's right. Some people pronounce it as crap. And those people would be me. Because I literally thought it was called crap for my whole life. I tried to order a piece of crap. <laughs> you know what they gave me? Not cool on DVD. <laughs> I'm kidding. I love my own movie. Do you? So yes, this is a crepe. I think. I don't know. I ordered crap. The chef might have actually taken a dump inside of this and I would not even know. I'm kind of sick so like my taste buds aren't really working. So I'm like ready to eat actual shit. All right, so here we go. It's kind of hard. I felt like it would be a lot softer, but hopefully when we get inside of it. Oh God. Do you hear the noise? Ugh. It sounds like a little kid like moving around in his bed he just peed in. <laughs> Memories. I really hope this is good. How could this not be good? Well, granted, I do not like strawberries and there's a lot of them. So I'm just gonna like move those aside. But I can fuck with Nutella and I could fuck with whatever the fuck this weird dough is. Also, there's no way that fucking beauty gurus eat this. I mean, unless they have like a really cute bedazzled sparkling gold trash can really close. Or like a really cute sparkly gold bedazzled toilet. But they don't show that on the gram because that's too real. Go to my gram for that. All right, here we go. We have the perfect little piece of crap and we're gonna eat it. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> that tastes like 500,000 likes. <laughs> Bitch, that tastes like a brand deal. Oh my God, that's fucked up. What is this? The chef, my crap. I keep telling people it's good. No, this is fucking good. It tastes like if a pancake and a quesarito, stay with me, got together, fuck, and then said, Ugh. I could go for some Nutella. And then they went to Ralph's, got some Nutella, was gonna go home and eat it while they watched Big Brother, but they ate it in the car on the way there because they're fatties. Then once they got home, they were so full of Nutella and so sick and felt so gross that they just got into bed and just laid there. 
for like 12 hours. And their bodies slowly melted into each other and then they like became one. And then they were just one big fucking gross clump of like dough and Nutella and sadness. And then this. <laughs> also, couple goals. Uh, no, this is amazing. I have just changed my entire life and I need to actually put this somewhere so I don't need it because fuck. Not being an Instagram model is really fucking hard and really fucking busy. Every day I have to get up, take a shower, do my hair, take a selfie, go back to bed. That's it. Well, I need my energy. So that's why every day I get my fancy ass espresso. Let me take a selfie. Yes, that is what this is, except this came in a go cup, so I don't have like the fancy little heart writing on top. Instead, I just have um, nothing. <laughs> So, story of my life. But I can't imagine this being bad. I've never had espresso before. I don't really know what that means. I think it means like extra caffeine. I remember Lindsay Lohan used to drink it and she'd have like heart palpitations. So, <laughs> I'm ready. All right, let's see. Oh my God. <laughs> that smells like a breakdown. <laughs> that smells like a fucking Instagram model who like deletes all her pictures and then uploads like one unfiltered one and goes, I'm done with filters. Like, that's what that smells like. Like a bitch who was losing her shit. All right, let's give it a try. Maybe we'll post an unfiltered picture. Nobody wants that. Oh my God. Oh my God. That tastes like gasoline. Oh my God, that tastes like Windex. No wonder gurus are fucking crazy. What are you drinking? This is actual like fuel. If I drank this whole thing, I could fly. I bet those bitches don't even have drone cameras. That's the bitches flying in the air with their fucking cameras after espressos. They're like, ooh, we should get a wide shot of this beautiful beach we're on. Hold on. And they just fly up into the air. Holy fuck. I hate that. That's wrong. That's dangerous. Oh my god, I'm just going to stick to my sugary ass pumpkin spice lattes and blended mochas, which are just milkshakes, because they're bomb. <laughs> <laughs> There's two people here. <laughs> All right, what else we got? Okay, so this next one is very confusing to me because technically it's a sandwich, but it looks like a salad. And listen, I'm all for transgender, but I'm not for trans foods. Like, I'm not trying to have nachos that looks like spaghetti. You know what I mean? I'm not trying to have ice cream that looks like a pickle. And this next one is in that same category. It's a sprout sandwich. Let me take a selfie. Yes, this little fucker is not a sandwich. There is no meat in there. There's no fake meat in there. It's literally bread and fucking grass. Once again, bitch, go to the park. You don't even wonder how much this was. They only give me half a sandwich. They didn't even give me a full one. You could literally just get two pieces of bread, go outside, and fucking eat a tree. But I'm just gonna give this a try, and I'm hoping it'll change my mind. There seems to be something else on it. <laughs> it smells like an armpit, so it'll blend right in. Here, can you, I just really want you to see that fucking beautiful sandwich. Ugh. All right, I'm angry. <laughs> Here we go. I like it. <laughs> oh no! I like it a lot! Oh, it tastes like... Mm. Like, I don't go to the park, cause like, outside, and like, sun. But this tastes like I'm at the park, and I was playing kickball with all my friends, and then like I fell, I was like sliding into home, and then I got a little grass in my mouth, a little sand in my mouth, and then a friend came and helped me up, and they gave me a little kiss on the mouth, and then that friend was my coach, and well, I stopped going to those games. But it's okay, because me and mommy won the legal battle, and <laughs> we got a lot of money. So it kind of tastes like that, mixed with like a summer day. I don't know, I fucking like it. I don't know what's in it. I think that's hummus, tomato, tree, I don't fucking know. But I like it, and I hate myself now. Don't blame the sandwich. <laughs> oh, sandwich. You're right. All right, we have one more left, and I'm really excited about this one because it's fucked up. <laughs> and I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. This is the super fancy pizza. Let me take a selfie. Okay, so this one I bought is a butternut squash, goat cheese, basil, something. And it looks like this. <laughs> that looks like the most confused emoji ever. But, like, I think it looks good, but I don't know... It has no smell, <laughs> so that's a good sign. Okay, let's cut this slice open. I mean, it's like 3D, you know what I mean? <laughs> what the fuck? Gurus have such interesting lives. This is so much different than Domino's or my 4 dollars Little Caesars pizza. All right, here we go. Let's live the rich life. <laughs> fuck off. That tastes like nothing. You know what? I don't care how much money you have, how many followers you have, how fucking cute you think you are, how many lit kits you own, nothing can replace the taste of some fucking trashy ass, cheap ass, gross ass fast food. You could give me like a thousand dollar burger, you could give me a million dollar steak, and guess what bitch, I want a quesarito. Cause that pizza tasted like 
nothing. And Little Caesars, bitch, she's everything. Domino's, bitch, don't get me started. DiGiorno, bitch, DiGior, yes. I guess I'll always just be a real ass bitch. And I'm okay with that. And if you want to see more of my real ass moments, go follow me on Instagram. I post so many fun Grammys. Likes for likes! All right, guys, guys, that was me trying fucking famous Instagram food. Do I have food in my teeth? Whatever, I'm famous. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and you want me to try more weird Instagram food. Also, make sure to subscribe to my channel right down below because I make new videos every fucking day. And if you want more videos of me trying out weird foods, I have a bunch of them. I'll put a link to a playlist right at the top of the description below. All right, you guys, I will see you little Grammys tomorrow. Bye. Okay, this is like a mask that you're supposed to wear to like block out the haters. I <laughs> know. <laughs> um, block out like the pimple from popping in your face. So let's just like, yes, queen. Oh my god. I just went up like five points. I went from a four. Well, I probably went up to a six, but that's great.